Hello, hello everybody. Welcome back to another video. Um, hope you're doing really well. It is a Wednesday today. Um, this is going to be a little day in the life, bit of a Wednesday routine. Um, I have quite a few things to do um, and I'm doing it all in the heat. How nice is this weather? It's lovely, it's nice and I'm enjoying it but at times it's a little too hot for me. I haven't I haven't been sleeping all that great in this heat um, actually about two nights ago I think I got about one hour sleep and then the following night I got about three hours <laughs> so I'm a little bit sleep deprived last night was a lot better um, but it's really affecting me um, I've been finding it really hard to get to sleep whereas normally I am just as soon as my head hits that pillar, I'm gone. Does anyone else have the same trouble in the heat? Um, but yeah, that being said, we must not complain. We must make the most of it. It's just, it just feels different, doesn't it, to when you're on holiday. Um, obviously, when you're on holiday, you know, you can just jump in the pool when you want to cool down. You're relaxing. It's just, it's just different altogether, isn't it? But I say, thank God for the aircon in the car. That's what I say. Anyway. All of that being said, enough of my moaning about the heat. Um, we are going to do Wednesday. I have to go down to Western Lakes today. I need to pick up quite a few bits for Atticus. Um, I need to get him some more light crepe paper for his homework. Um, we're doing, well, I'm helping him do like a volcano. And um, I got lots of stuff from Hobbycraft the other day. But um, I did forget to get some green crepe paper, which he needs for like the ground he wants green. So I need to go and pick that up. I need to go and get him some school shorts um, in grey because um, obviously it's getting hotter and probably a little bit too hot for trousers. Um, I also need to get him some PE shorts um, and also some like short pajama sets um, or comfy shorts to wear at night. Um, I also probably need to pick a couple of pairs up for myself because I have no shorts. There you go. Um, so that's a trip to Primark also, so I will take you along with me. Um, but yeah, a very, very sunny, Hot Wednesday I think it's going to be about 26 degrees today but before we start Wednesday I'm going to talk to you about HelloFresh HelloFresh saves the day for me every time especially <laughs> in this heat in this heat I have I'll be honest not a lot of energy I don't have a lot of energy um, I don't have a great deal of motivation I don't know why and obviously we still need to eat we still need to eat healthy and fresh and HelloFresh provides that for me basically I will go online I will choose my recipes for the week my recipes will arrive in the box all the fresh ingredients all ready for me to cook so so Week. so let's go down to the kitchen I will show you um, some of my recipes for this week and I will also show you what I had for dinner last night when I had zero energy and we still wanted something tasty nutritious um, so I cooked one of our favorite meals I cooked steak last night um, steak is always a big hit in this house and the hello fresh um, it's the 31 day matured steak is just mwah. So um, we had that last night and I've also got a fab, fab code for you also to get many off your own HelloFresh boxes. So let's go down to the kitchen and we'll have a chat about HelloFresh. my steak from last night and the cheesy and bacon potatoes I'd never cooked anything like that before and it was so so tasty and went really well with the steak first of all HelloFresh's range they have such a fab range they've got like 
44 plus recipes to choose from each week so you're going to find something that everyone likes um they have fish vegetarian um international specialities one of mine i've got um chicken tikka um masala recipe which i will show you um such a fab fab range you can also choose what type of recipe you prefer so um like family dishes um low calorie dishes even um rapid cook um recipes which i tend to choose most of the time um to save time because you really want to save time this summer don't you you know you want to be out there relaxing in the garden not cooking for endless amounts of time in the kitchen um so you would have seen my steak what i had last night and then also this week i've got the ultimate chicken tikka and rice with crispy shallot topping and garlic coriander naan lovely i think i'm going to do this one on friday night because i do like a curry on friday and also i have got this one i've had before and it is really one of my favorites from Hello fresh it's the fragrant pork and mushroom stir fry um with zesty rice this is so good and a really great thing as well there's no commitment um you can pause your deliveries um you can cancel your subscription at any time you want to also as well because we do go away quite a bit um hello fresh is really handy for when we get back um i don't have that empty fridge you know i've already booked a delivery to come it the meals are there ready um so that is a really really fab thing as well to consider this summer so if you use my code what is on screen now and also it's in the description box 60JS, you will get a massive 60% off your first Hello Fresh box, then you will get 25% off your next eight boxes. So that is a really, really fab code for you to use. The link is in the description box below. So that is Hello Fresh, and now it is time for me to get on with my Wednesday. It is about, it's 20 to 8 almost, so it is time for Atticus to come upstairs. He's going to get ready, he's had his cereal. We are going to do the school run and then it's time I'm going to go down to um, Richard Lakes, do the things. I might get a coffee because that is what I do. And uh, yeah, come along with me and let's do Wednesday. Just come to sit in the car for a minute. Um, hydrate, get some water. It's really hot. It's really hot already, and it's like about half past ten. Um, successful shopping trip. I got. Um, I, think I told you I got Atticus's school shorts in Marks and Spencers, which I wanted. Resisted the clothes in there. Um, went into Primark. Got his like pajama short sets. What he wanted. Got myself a couple of sets as well. Um, I did get a pair of trousers in Primark because they were just so so nice. I couldn't resist them. Um, and they're that like linen material which everything I wear seems to be at the moment I just love it, it's so cool and comfortable um, then I did go into um, Shoe to um, have a look at the Birkenstocks because I don't know what is happening with I don't know what I'm doing with half the stuff I have because um, I know I bought some new Birkenstocks last year and wore them to death all summer and I know for a fact I didn't throw them away because I would just wouldn't do that. They're like, you don't buy a new pair every year. Um, I went to put them on yesterday, went to find them yesterday in like the shoe cupboard. I can't find them. I can't find them. So I just went into shoe um, and found some. Um, I'll show you when I get home. They're like a navy, which was really nice with like the black buckle. Um, last year I had brown and I wanted something a bit different. And I saw they were £65 and normally they're a lot dearer than that, um, Birkenstocks. I think last year I paid like 90 or something. Um, so yeah, a lot cheaper. I tried to get Atticus some sandals, what he was looking at the other day. Um, some Adidas-like sandals he wanted. Um, but they didn't go up to a three. They only went up to a two. So I'll just have to take him in and he'll have to choose some others. Um, they had kids' Birkenstocks. Um, I was going to take him home a pair of them. 
they didn't have um, his size in any of the colours of them so I think we're just gonna have to try somewhere else for Atticus um, but I've managed to get all of his stuff I've just got to go to Hobbycraft and get his green paper but I'm gonna head up to Tiger have a little browse in there because I do like their summary bits they have um, and then we'll go and get his crepe paper from Hobbycraft and then we will head home. The traffic's eased because um, coming to Western Lakes from Wellingborough on the A45, um, on the other side, going back to Wellingborough, it was like, I'm not kidding, the queue was about five miles long. There'd been an accident, I think. Right, so I'm in the car now, everything's done, I'm going home. And um, before I do, I thought I'd show you this. This is the air freshener that I got from the White Company. And what it is, if I take it out the vent, I've got the aircon on. You can see inside here, there's like a sponge. And what you do, you choose your oil. I mean, I'd already got um, three oils anyway, but I got this one in Cambridge. I got Wild Mint. And then you soak the sponge that's inside. Um, I said to him in the shop, how many? He says, if you like it strong, probably 15 to 20 drops. Um, then obviously stick it on the vent. Then when you've got the aircon on or whatever, I mean, you can smell it anyway. It's really lovely. Um, but the smell is starting to go a little bit. So I'm going to dab some more. I'm going to put probably about another 10 drops on here it's really good that it came with this and then three sponge no two sponge refills and then you can buy the sponge refills separate but it's quite nice because like in winter you could have like the winter scent or whatever so i am home it's about midday <laughs> God, it's so hot. everyone in the uk hot in it hot in it <laughs> I am going to sit outside, I am going to have my chocolate donut from Greg's and a nice cup of tea and loads of water. I'll turn you around and show you just how much we get the sun in my garden. It's like, I think it's meant to be 26, 27 the temperature today. I can guarantee in my garden it's literally 30 something. It's parasol um, and the stand, I was looking everywhere for a good stand. Um, found one at B&M and I've got this parasol that I couldn't even sit out there. If I didn't have this parasol, I couldn't sit out there. It is literally like being in an oven out there. It, you know, we have such, we get the sun so much. Um, so this parasol is a complete lifesaver. As promised, I'll show you my new Birkenstocks. So I got the um, blue colour. It's coming up on camera a lot bluer, if that makes sense. Um, but it's a very dark, very dark navy um, with the black um, buckles. Um, really comfortable as they always are. I know the ones I had last year, which I cannot find, but will probably turn up now. Um, I just wore them to death. I wore them on holidays. Um, they're just really, really comfortable. Also got this to go in my um, reading pile. I'm reading at the moment, um, Stolen Focus. I can hardly put it down. Um, I'm always trying to read it when Atticus has gone to bed at night and I have to like force myself to put it down. It's that good. Um, but this is going to go in the pile, the to read pile. It's called The Brain. It's the new scientist. A user's guide to the supercomputer inside your head and the works. They did such good prices on the books. Prove lateral thinking, make better decisions, boost your memory and be more creative. Take the psychopath test, discover sleep hacks and train your brain in this exhilarating journey through perception, consciousness, learning, intelligence and beyond. The brain will help you understand the supercomputer inside your head and show you what it's capable of. That sounded really, really good to me. I'm actually like sort of trying to start on Instagram, like a, a sort of a book club type thing. Um, I'm going to put each book up what... 
um, I'm going to show each book what I'm reading on my stories each time um, and then sort of ask, give me your opinions on it, have you read it? Um, I thought it'd be quite interesting reading and I thought it's good to get other people's opinions as well. So each new book that I start, I'm going to put it on my story on my Instagram. Give me your opinions, tell me if you've read it. Um, so yeah, so this one will be on there. I think I will probably, after I've finished Stolen Focus, I think I will read a novel. Um, and then I will probably get stuck into this one. So many books, so many books to read out there, isn't there? There's just so many books and so little time. Um, but yeah, so looking good. This one is looking really, really good. Looking forward to reading this one. And it is almost time. I'm going to have a cold coffee and then it is almost time to pick Atticus up. It's boiling out there. It's absolutely boiling i know i keep saying it i am your typical british moaner that it's too hot but it really is too hot <laughs> It is now, I think it's about seven o'clock. I am gonna end this day in the life here. Um, we've had dinner, Atticus's bath, he's chilling. Um, I'm gonna wash my face, get my makeup off. I am so hot, I shoved my hair up. I am so hot and sweaty. I'm gonna get this makeup off. I am gonna chill for a while and then I am gonna come up here in the office and I'm gonna do some work up here because it is the coolest room in the house. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this little day in the life. Um, my code and link for HelloFresh is in the description box below. Um, give it a try, it saves you so much time. Um, and I will see you soon for another video. Bye.